Google accidentally leaked their latest AI product, which is called the Gemini CLI, which is essentially their AI coding agent that lives directly in the terminal. Imagine it as a cloud code or an open AI codex competitor, but just powered with Gemini instead. You've already been able to use Gemini in AI coding editors like Windsurf and Cursor, but now Google is getting in on creating their own agentic experience, and I'm very excited for this. The AI coding war is getting super interesting because previously you only had these apps like Windsurf and Cursor that existed at the app layer, but now you're seeing the actual LLM creators diving into the agentic coding experience. And in my opinion, I think it's going to be better performing than the ones that exist solely at the app layer like Cursor and Windsurf. Now, what I'm going to say here is totally not backed by some rigorous AI LLM testing. This is all just by gut feel but I've used Claude Opus 4 within Cloud Code and in Cursor as well, but I find the performance within directly Cloud Code to be better than that performance within Cursor. And I think there's some credibility to my statement when I say that the creators of these LLMs know how to create a better agentic coding experience than the creators of these app level app layer applications like Cursor and Windsurf. A little bit of a tinfoil hat moment right here, but I also do think that these AI code editors that exist solely on the app layer, they do artificially truncate the context that is passed into these LLMs to help manage their costs as well. And I think that by artificially truncating the context that's passed into the LLM on every single agentic coding turn, it ends up reducing the code output and the actual performance by the agentic coding model. And that's why, in my opinion, Cloud Opus 4 directly within Cloud Code performs better than Cloud Opus 4 directly within Cursor. And I wouldn't be surprised if I see a similar experience with the Gemini coding CLI performing better with Gemini 2.5 Pro there than the same exact model being used within Cursor or Windsurf. I'm personally really excited for the Gemini CLI to launch because before I switched over to using Cloud Opus 4 and Cloud Code, Gemini 2.5 Pro was my go-to model. So I'm really hoping the Gemini CLI comes out and I hope it works great because I'm really, really excited to test out Gemini 2.5 Pro in my coding workflow again.